Hello and welcome to P Guru's channel. I'm your host Sri Iyer. Today I'm back talking to you about the possible composition of the Indian cricket team for the first test against England starting on the 5th of February in Chennai. Now, the second test is also going to be played in Chennai starting on the 13th of February and I'm expecting four changes in the Indian cricket team. Mayank Agarwal makes way for Virat Kohli. Then we have Natarajan making way for Jasprit Bumrah. Washington Sundar will make way for Ravichandan Ashwin. And uh, we might see Navdeep Saini make way for Ishan Sharma. The, all, the, the other possibility is that it might be Shardul Thakur making way for Ravi, Ravichandran Ashwin if they think that the wicket is going to aid more spin. But we don't know at this point. Four days ago, when someone looked at the wicket, it looked very green. However, we know that two or three days before the test match starts, they will mow the grass, then they might decide who's they. There are the people who, like for example, the host team captain, the host team coach, the host uh, team uh, board, BCCI, the local cricket association, and so on and so forth, because they know who is match fit based on that they might want to make some changes on which way they want to have the pitch be laid out you certainly know that england can swing the ball and in india the the ball does reverse after 40 uh, to 60 overs or so so that is the point that would be one of the things that people will look forward to doing so if you think about all these things my gut feeling tells me that it's going to be a cracker of a match and since there are two tests back to back my guess is there are about a dozen strips laid down and one will be used for the first test and another one will be used for the second test so we'll have to wait and see how this plays out what you're seeing back on the background is the montage for the lord's cricket ground in other words if you go to the lord's cricket ground website this is what plays out and i'm hoping that they will not uh, strike this off because of a copyright I'm just trying to promote the World Test Championship which is going to be played right here in this stadium in July 2021 now who are going to be the finalists as things stand today India is at number one and New Zealand is in number two position this could change if for example uh, Australia goes to South Africa and sweeps the series there and uh, also if India does poorly against England then it is possible that uh, Australia might uh, make it ahead of uh, New Zealand and it's also possible that uh, India might make way for Australia and it might be an Australia New Zealand final for the World Test Championship and for the honor of being the best cricket team in the whole world we we'll have to wait and see how things play out it is my expectation that India will do very well I expect India to perhaps win 4-0 uh, or maybe 4 or 3-0. I don't expect England to win because it's um, this is coming on the back of a very difficult series that India managed to master in Australia, defeating Australia in Australia when they were at full strength. My God. And India was playing with its... Uh, uh, you know, uh, uh, every time, every test match had a new set of bowlers. It was just incredible what India managed to pull off. So India would be brimming with confidence. Let's hope that uh, that confidence comes across to this series and that India wins against England, in which case it will put the matter beyond doubt and India would be in the finals of the World Test Championship. Do subscribe to P Guru's channel and please donate to our cause. Thanks for watching and good luck India.